Good morning, Primary 2. This is Chapter 5, Lessons 48, 49, and 50. The Solids. Today, you're going to talk about the solids. Solid shapes. You can see a red triangle. In the next page, you will see a cube, a sphere, cylinder, pyramid, prism, cuboid, and cone. We will talk about each solid of these ones. In the next page, in any solid, you have edge, face, and vertex. Edge, face, and vertex. What is the meaning of these three words? The vertex is always a point, a point where two lines meet. A vertex is a point. An edge is a line. The edge is a line that you can see. The face is the face that you can see when you look at the shape. The first thing that you see when you look at the shape. Let's start with the cube. How many faces can you see when you look at the cube? You have six faces. Each face is in the shape of a square. You can see a square. When you look to the cube, you can see a square in front of you. How many edge can you see? How many line can you see and count? That's right, 12. How many vertices can you see? Vertex is one, vertices is many. So you have eight vertices in the cube. The cuboid is the same as the cube, except in one thing. The faces are in the shape of rectangle. In the cube, you had squares. In the cuboid, you had all the faces are in the shape of rectangle. You have six faces, rectangular shape. You have 12 edges and you have eight vertices. In the cylinder, like the can of the Pepsi that you can drink, you have two bases in the shape of the circle. When you look from above and from the bottom, you can see two circles. You have no edge, you have no point, you have no vertices. The sphere, the ball that you can see in your room, it has no face, no vertex, and no edge. So you have edge, vertex, and face for each solid. In the next page, from your book page 74, you can see a table, the name, the shape, number of faces, number of edges, and number of vertices. Let's start with the first shape, the square-based pyramid. Square-based pyramid, because the base of this shape is square, so we call it square-based pyramid. It has four faces, it has eight edges, and five vertices. The next shape is the cylinder. The cylinder seems like the can of the Pepsi. It has two faces in the shape of circle. It has zero edges and zero vertices. The sphere, the ball, it has zero faces, zero edges, and zero vertices. The cube, the cube is like the dice when you play with your friend with dice. It has six faces, 12 edges, and eight vertices. And remember, in the cube, all the faces are in the shape of square. The rectangular prism, it has six faces, 12 edges, and eight vertices. And all the shapes are, all the faces are rectangle. This is from your book page 74. In the next page, book page 76, Cut all the shapes that you can see and put them to the similar shapes in the next line. You have cuboid or rectangular prism. You have square-based pyramid. You have a sphere. You have a dice. You can use your scissors to cut and paste. This is from your book, page 76. In the next page, page 77, you have a table. In the first place you have to write the shape or draw the shape with four or more faces shape of four or more faces you have cube you have cuboid these are shapes with four or more faces then shapes with zero edges zero faces and zero vertex we didn't take except one shape that has zero zero and zero and this is the sphere shape with one vertex 
you can write the cone the cone has only one vertex down there is a shape with six or more edges six or more edges again you can write the cuboid the cube or the square pyramid and then shapes with at least one circle face at least means minimum we took uh, what we took what with circular face we took the cylinder that's right and the last one are shapes with more than two faces but fewer than six more than two but less than six that's right you have the square based pyramid thank you and see you next time